Hello YouTube, how y'all doing? We're over here on my web page and we're looking at this new page I just put up. Martial Law. Massive car to car. You know, I, you know people, I, I don't get this. I, I really don't. Look at these guys. They stop traffic in the middle of the highway. Let's go down to the bottom of the page. They stop traffic. They fly down the highway and they run and they cut off the highway. So they're blocking all those people up back there. No matter where the people are, and they cut this side of the road off too. No matter where it is, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where it's at. But they blatantly blocked off the road. Now, if what if somebody back there in the back was having a heart attack or some woman was having a baby or anything like that, was in a rescue squad, not in no hurry or, you know, nothing like that. Just, you know, plainly stating. They were in a rescue squad being transferred from one place to another, or a kidney was being transferred for someone that was on a hospital bed. It doesn't matter for what. It doesn't. It doesn't matter. You got to pay attention to this, people. It's time. It really is time. And I, this is another video. You might want to watch this one too. This is where they rate it. They raid and you can read the title. Just go there and look. Now, next thing I want to show you is to abolish the Act 1871. And if you click on this photo, it takes you to another page with several pages of things to learn that you can use to tell people about, that you can download, you can send it to your friends, whatever it whatever it may be we need to get this information out to everybody we need to quit chasing the rabbit holes and the rabbit holes and the rabbit holes because these particular rabbit holes every time you see this right here they already have the law to do it. It's all behind them to take your rights away. Basically what they're telling you and screaming at you in this video, and if you read the article, it'll tell you that the woman was told to shut her door and she was told, not asked, told get back in your car, stay in your car, hollering and screaming, yelling and shouting. And that's in, hmm, what happened to the other video? Well, now, ain't that strange. Well, anyway, there's another video. I guess, um, hmm, it already got taken down already. It's kind of weird. But anyway, point being, because there will be another video on here. It ain't here right now. If I can find it again. Um, or a newscast is telling everybody. And they're promoting it. Like it's a good thing. They're stopping three bank robbers. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Listen to me closely. Three armed robbers. And they're going to put those three armed robbers. I look. Amongst all of these people and all of these cars, and they go way on back that way, and all of these, and way on back this way. All they had to do was get out of their car and grab somebody as a hostage, or just got out and started shooting, and somebody could have got hurt. Is that what y'all want in life? I mean, really, is that what y'all want in life? Do you want to be a slave? You want to give up your freedoms to be a slave? Because that's what you're doing. 
That's what you're doing. You play idiotic games. Some of you on YouTube. You play idiotic games. You have your own opinion of being stupid. Some of you. Some of you are, are brain scholars. And you're good. But some of you, I, I just don't get it. All you want to do is play games and not worry about anything. Like, everything's going to be okay. Or you work for the man. And if you do that, then the same thing's going to happen to you. Even if you're wearing one of these badges and you're just like these two guys right here. Or these these three guys right four guys right here you're gonna be the same as they are you're doing the evils work for them but when it comes time just like the military they're gonna come after you if you're in the military and you get out and you get in the arm of law enforcement you've already been trained that's why they want you because they want what you know and your actions with guns but really I mean think about it think about that folks and they don't want the ones that abide by the law in the military they want the wild ones the wilder they are the, the more crazy things they done the better they like you why? Because you'll take orders better. You'll do what they want you to do because you just have that itch to kill. Is that what y'all want? Is that what the rest of y'all want? No freedoms at all? Because that's what's coming. If we don't abolish, if we don't abolish Act 1871, and more of y'all don't start helping to push this we're gonna lose this battle and I'm not talking about little youtubers I'm talking about the big ones and I'm talking about the ones that's got you know 150 150,000 subscribers 200,000 subscribers stuff like that I'm talking about the real truthers that say they're truthers but got all the subscribers and all they talk about is bullshit. All they do is repeat the news and distract you from what's really happening to your rights. I mean it. Straight up. Straight from the heart. Right on to throughout to all of you. I mean it. I love... I love people and I love my freedom. And I'm not doing this to get rich. I ain't doing this to hurt no one's feelings. I'm not doing this to be mean to people. I'm not doing this to talk down to people. But when you get as many comments as I do and emails that are discouraging, hateful, distracting and damn right bullshit and then the very next day you get some shit like this and everybody's an up in arms about it but no one's willing to stand up for their rights no one's willing to stand up and fight and I don't mean with a gun just with the knowledge of you knowing that you are or have freedoms is up to you. You people need to learn to do the right research. Quit rubbing the rap quit running around and chasing the rabbit hole like a hmm like a lawyer. Amulet's chaser. If everybody was to circle around this right here and start working on it 
and push it down the mainstream media since they watch our stuff now. They watch all the fear mongering porn stars to get out there and push their fear and then they push the mainstream media with it. If you start pushing this right here, maybe we could get it in the mainstream media and then more people would wake up. The more we have awake, the better off we're going to be. The more people's going to stand up. But the ones of you that don't want that and think that we're going to get rich and we're going to get free money, you know, I'm going to tell you now, get your Vaseline and, you know, wipe your butt real good with it because it's going to hurt if you don't. When you find out that that's all bullshit, it's going to hurt real bad. And like before, you rode the wrong pony and the wrong pony won. You get my drift? So with that, folks, you know, I really had nothing else to say. This is disturbing. It's disgusting. It's just me seeing my rights fly out the window. I can't get out of the I could if I was in traffic right here, I couldn't get out of my car, I couldn't move. I'm trapped. You would be trapped. Your child would be trapped. You got a a a two year old or a three year old in the back seat, in the car seat, screaming its little head off, sitting in a car seat, and you can't get out. You can't do anything for the child. You can't even turn around to mess with the child. It's got to sit there and scream. That's right, just to catch a bank robber. An armed bank robber at that. Shouldn't they done that in some other area where they could do it a little bit easier? Where they didn't block off traffic and, uh, involve innocent citizens y'all think that's right I don't think y'all do and you know leave your comments I have them on you know they still they're still there you can still make a comment it might just take a little while sometimes if I'm asleep for me to approve it but it'll get approved most of them get approved anyway. It's just the real stupid ones. Or the ones I don't feel like recommenting to. And I don't comment the messages anyway. I don't have time. I have to check all the idiotic information that comes out to make sure it's true, whether it's fake. So with that, folks, much love to y'all. Y'all have a great day. And remember this from my cold, dead hands.